All right, folks, the deck is Elemental Quest Shaman. The goal of the deck is to complete the Corrupt the Waters quest so that we can reduce the cost of our elementals, repeat their battle cries so that we can send a bunch of damage at our opponent's dome. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash raffle. Watch this! That's very, very advantageous for me. Okay. That's interesting. I'd already forgotten about it, the anomaly. This hand is kind of doo doo. But at least the anomaly is working for me. Balance in all things. Um, this could just be a lightning storm next turn. I have no way of knowing what that secret is, so just pray it's not ice block. Or, yeah, pray it's not ice block, clear it. Oh my god, if it's ice block and there's a Tess. block but that's pretty brutal for me I have no playable cards at least no cards that I'm excited to play I guess I could play the snowball next turn but sure just the dungeon here. for me. Oh. Nature waits. Any lightning storms? It's also not bad, I suppose. That's pretty bad, though. Okay. Got one cost reducer. Raffle ruining opponent's fun? Look, I've been having that happen to me all day today. I think they're doing just fine anyway. So this will cost four next turn, right? Please trade. Is 
it'll cost four. This will cost six still. If I hero power here, it reduces this by two. That'll still be playable. really funny. Kudos to the opponent for going out of the way to play a trick to him, though. Got another great example of why we don't kill trick totems. It's just morally incorrect. I just need to draw the blaze collar and we should be able to get there. Shutter would be funny, yeah. People viscerally dislike Shudder. Even in situations and decks where he's not very good. I just need to make sure that I play things back down in the correct order. Follow the same order I did last turn. You belong to the bog now. This ends up turning into like a DIY shutter, I guess. This could be a throw, but we're so close to winning from here. I just need like a blaze caller or Calamos.
Trying to avoid giving them board space, but... What's going on with their tiny board here? Look at how cute it is. Oh, it's bad. I've got a good curve here. Cartoon. Alright. The important thing is we did draw a good curve. Orison could be a good coin turn four play. So probably just go Sleep Breaker into Dunganir. Cthune seems so weird with uh, Renathal. Yeah, it's maybe indicating that they're not all in on the uh, Cthune because I don't think you want to slow down the uh, Cthune pieces. They're already the problem with them is that they're already very slow. Time is running out. Come on, man. It's always when I'm at limited time that the roping really starts to come out. Could be a decent follow-up to the Dungeoneer. I guess it doesn't interrupt it to play the Thoris in next turn, though. I think people just throw out armor way too quickly a lot of times. Like, they don't know what I'm doing. If they don't have playable cards, why not use draw? That could indicate, like, a mill game plan, though, and they're just trying to empty hand. Just want to get cards out of hand in case of something weird. Like some due process shenanigans or even a naturalize. Okay. Nature waits for no one. No cost reducers yet. Drain away. Job's done. Pull some more. Drain away. It's probably the least important right now. All eight of my cost reducers are in the, or, or all four of my cost reducers are at the bottom of my deck. It's likely to make it a little tough. What? Is that just to set up a floop?
Okay. I needed to play an elemental there to uh, continue the chain. Is it an alignment turn? Sure does. By the elements this card has been underwhelming, but can be good if we um, hit it off of the dungeoneer. How did I queue into two of these two games in a row? Well met. This deck's terrible. Uh, frogs are it. Thank you for the prime. That's really unfortunate. I'll tempo one of these out next turn, but this is uh, not great value without going in on or around the combo turns. We're gonna be rich! Ah yes, the famous Wild West period of Azeroth's history, during the Westward Expansion, Manifest Destiny, Era of Kalimdor. Are you serious, Blizzard? No. What? I think it's great that they're doing a Wild West-themed expansion. I'm surprised it took them this long, to be Gosh honest with you. Kinda sweet. But thank you, Sake. Like, I feel like Hearthstone is at its best when it explores some of the goofier things than, like, your typical Warcraft expansion would do. Everyone has their preferences. The new expansion feels very Festival of Legends-ish. That is not what came to my mind, but I don't know. Again, everybody has different uh, references and ideas. I'm doing this for the sake of the um, raised dead. I don't want a crystallizer back in there. a turn. Sure would be a shame if someone uh, lightning stormed this board. Most rising. 
Uh, Sake, thank you for the another uh, tip. I'm surprised they still haven't added the monk class as some sort of passive bounce-related hero power or mechanic. Uh, I mean, we just got Death Knight, right? They they seem to be spacing out some of the uh, some of the additional heroes, but we'll see. There's no guarantee they won't do that. I don't have any insider information, but I do know that like a lot of people were predicting that they would announce the expansion at BlizzCon. And so now they've got to announce something at uh, BlizzCon, right? I'm not saying it's a new hero, but like the early expansion announce does indicate something potentially pretty cool at uh, BlizzCon. Or at least something uh, quite a bit larger. Uh, I don't think that the announcement has or the early announcement had anything to do with the leak. Nature waits for no one but me. I need to save the wind chill for the uh, Tamsin. All of Stormwind shall share my pain. Well met, love all the fun deck. Hey, appreciate that, Tawa. Glad you're enjoying them. We're getting there. Wait, this is 10, 16. Yeah, I need to grumble. Ideally before we die, which is asking a lot. Snipe with parrot, we... Yeah, we might actually be forced into that situation. Or we could just be really good at the game. You're the good card. Like, this card is so good, I want to bog slosh it. Twitch streamers are billionaires? Yeah, if you ask chat, they are. Bog slosher, I hardly knew her. That's my line. She slosh on my bog till I grumble. I don't know if that. Oh my god, we drew both of them again. He can't keep getting away with it. Yeah, I, I, I just can't stop sloshing on these bogs. Minions are more important than the spells, so I think. 
they're very clearly, very likely going to pick minion here. So just do this. And the downside is pretty minimal. We can move on from this conversation. It's not productive. A league streamer once said that every streamer except him is a millionaire, so checkmate? Yeah. <laughs> we need to trust the league players to be the voice of reason and rational thought. I understand that I'm saying that as a Hearthstone streamer and a streamer in general, but I'm aware and, like, honest about my brain rot. My minion's attacking isn't honestly even that important. This does play around, like, um, Mutanus pretty well, right? That's a gift. Oh, I had the one mana Calamos! I think I just keep both of the Dungeoneers. Oh, I'm massive still. Sorry about that. Ah, ah, I see you broadcast. Okay. It's better than an even shaman robot. You'll love to see it. Hey yo, I've got that card. Okay, that's also quite good. I would like to double that up, but it's probably not necessary. So, we'll see. Also a good one to have. We've got decent cost reduction. These are both very good with the uh, Grumble as well. Just jamming. Nature waits for no one but me. Okay. 
that's a lot of damage. Or that's a lot of reduction at least. Got them, boys. Okay, probably will be time to start getting some of the cost reduction soon. Probably start with the, Our gift of the arcane us. Harbinger. I don't know. Bzz. I've already got a lot of damage. And I've got a devolve in hand for that. It's fine. This is 61532. I think I have no lethal. If I have hand space for it. Uh, there's probably lethal in this. But I didn't have the time to sort it out. Actually, it was like mega lethal since I could just bog slosher the grumble. Engaging TC-130 until this Wait, what? Oh, skipper. Our gift of frost shields us. Ah, uh, we still have enough just between this and this. Thank you to legendary patrons Battlefly, Blage, Brian Quinn, Bay Cinderheart, Fizzle Jizzix, Free All the House Elves, Industrials Black, Justice Crater, Kali Alkali, Cathandrian, Lilu, Nate Drex, Onu Rubu, Shadow One TV, Sognisman, and Wampus Thylampus.